We are back with another video. What's good? What's good? And we're just getting back from the tire shop. We just got loads of new tires. Picked up 12 in total. Dude didn't believe us. Called yeah. him yesterday. He said, you need 12? <laughs> and we picked up 235, 45, 18s. They're like random used tires. But, you know, you got to start somewhere before we get that spot tire sponsorship. You know, from Kenda. We got to go do my coolant tank. We're going to do Josh. On the G. Um gonna be a little ghetto but hey yeah i will show you guys in a minute but yeah let's get these in the backyard okay so today we have this like i don't even know what is this it's just a regular little coolant bottle and we're gonna use that for now so that we can actually beat on the car because you need somewhere for the coolant to go when it actually gets hot because right now we just have it routing back into the radiator and that's fine for like driving around but if the car raises in temperature the coolant needs somewhere to expand to so this is an expansion tank and we're going to add that like right somewhere in this area and run these lines into the expansion tank so that we don't have any overheating issues when we do get it hot and update on the power steering bottle i ended up cutting the bracket and just using the de bracket and it kind of works it's in a good spot and it sits level it's close to the intake but it's not going to be an issue when we actually use the long tube intakes and they'll come to the front here <laughs> It's decent. We can keep it there. Like we're lower than the. Yeah, we make everything the, the, we need. We're lower than just, here yeah. and higher than here. Well, the hood shut is the question. Or do we have to cut this off so the hood can shut? I think it'll shut. Okay. Well, yeah, this is higher no, than here. Good. This good. is higher than this. Yeah, end. no, we're good. Okay, so we'll just fit it there. So we're here at the spot, y'all. There were a couple of cars pulling in into the regular parking lot when uh, we were pulling in. So I'm going to go check right now, make sure we're good. Nobody's going to come back here because this is our, our limit. Get the rear spinning first. You're just pushing the fronts. To die. <laughs> You're gonna let her cool off. I'll I'll take the Z out for a quick rip. Yeah, is that long enough? <laughs> yeah, it 
probably needs a little bit more, but I'm impatient. It's drying up. You kind of have to to get it to go and then stay in it. Like, but remember, first gear is tight donuts, so you're gonna be tight. Not looking for. Don't look for the wide donut yet. I feel like you're trying to stretch it too wide for first gear. Is what's spinning you out. Yeah. Trying to spin tight. So I just try getting consistently going. Yeah. That manji was sick though. When you manji I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> you gotta see it on camera. <laughs> yeah, it was insane. That's what I'm saying. I told you it wasn't enough. You don't have any gas? It'll finish it. Gas. Yo, I'm on E. I didn't keep it till yeah. now. That's... It has like the light on type shit. I didn't see the light. Oh, okay. We got Manny in the back. Wave at him, wave at him. <laughs> <laughs> I mean dry now. Yeah, he just spat a, spat spat a whole shoot <laughs> shoot at us.
Ben says you're about to pop your tires. Hey, Lamb. Good old Pirellis. Pirellis doing what they do best. Drift tire review. Don't get Pirellis. No. Because they be Lamb. That was a lot. Just told you we were going to call them today. Yeah. Hot as fuck. Yeah, it's hot as hell. All right, we got both of the Joshes suited up. He is ripping! 